Hey, what's up? This is where I work all day. I'm an instructional designer, uh, video producer, voiceover talent, um, graphic designer. Uh, I do a lot of stuff uh, with media. I'm also a professor of media communication. So I need to have a lot of toys, okay? Check this out. Say you don't have enough uh, space on your, your laptop right? And you want some storage space that'll work for you. But um, you also want to be able to transfer media easily between, say, your camera and your computer. Not, I don't always want to use USB ports for this. You know what I mean? I oftentimes want to, plus I want to utilize these extra little ports that are on the computer. You know what I mean? Like uh, the mini, not the mini, uh, the, the C USB ports. And I think there's another one that's called a, a lightning bolt or something like that. This guy has that. This is an MSI Creator laptop. Awesome computer for people like me. Now, what I have here is a mini SD card, right? It's 512, I have it upside down. It's 512, oh, it's backwards, that's what, no, it's 128, sorry, 128. Um, gigabytes of space. I also have some 512s. This is really cool because that's a lot of RAM. A lot, not a lot of RAM, a lot of storage space. So this is really convenient for somebody like me. I can take this out of a camera and stick it in the slot here. And then right away, I have access to those files. So you see, I have two of them. And so I'm not, I really don't have as many USB ports on this thing as I want. A lot of computers are like that. They, they also, they're not offering as much storage space as they used to because they think everybody wants to use the cloud. I want my files with me, you know what I mean? When I have access to them. So that's one really cool thing that I like about the way things are set up here on these computers when it comes to SD cards. The SD cards can now store enough information and content that it's it's really worth it. Another thing is large USB, or not USB, but uh, SD card slot. Again, because the SD cards have a high enough um, amount of space on them that it's really worth it. Now, this is my 512. Yeah, this is my 512. 512, yeah. Anyway, that's 512. So I just put that in the SD card the large SD card and stick it in that slot. So you don't always have to have these really big clunky external um, drives and you don't necessarily have to have a big hard drive. Just need it to be big enough and you can use these little high gig SD cards instead. Um, now, I, of course, I do have a traditional, this is like three terabytes of external uh, storage space, and I, I do like having that though. Why do I have uh, these little L adapters here? Well, the thing is that I don't have a lot of workspace, you know, so I, I need to be able to move my mouse around enough. And if these were just sticking out the regular, okay, here we go, um, the regular um, extender uh, or adapter, then they would be extending out in my way of my mouse. As, with these L brackets, they go up. It's easy to see, you know, whether or not the SD is in. It has a little light that comes on and off. And actually, this is two items, <laughs> if I can get them apart. Okay, so this L bracket is just for the port, right? It's a male and a female. C USB, I believe it's called. And then this guy, this guy right here, is for the SD card. These are awesome. There are not a lot of them available but they even have a little LED light that comes on and kind of lets you know what it's doing. So I pop these together, right? And then, gotta find the other slot, just pop it in there, light comes on, and when I wanna transfer media, all I have to do is take out the SD card and put it in there. Or I can use it as continuous place for storage. Now, one bit of advice I will give you is um, if you have to reboot or if you turn your computer on, take all of these external storage devices off of your computer, let the computer start up on its own. Otherwise it may try to start the, uh, the external drives and it'll take forever to come back on. So you don't want that. If you have any questions, let me know. Link in the bio.